Well, thousands of breast cancer patients, survivors, and their friends and family got up early on this Mother's Day to walk and also run in support of the fight against breast cancer. Yeah, the 20th annual Why Me race mm -hmm. started at 8 o'clock this morning in Grand Park. And this morning, we're happy to have uh, a whole family joining us, a family of survivors, if you will. Steve, Debbie, Courtney, and Stephanie are there this morning. Thanks so much for being here. Did you guys just finish? We did, yes. Thank you. Oh, great. First of all, tell me a little bit about the story that brought you there ago, because it was, what, five years ago that, that your whole world changed. I can't hear, honey. Uh, we're having a tough time hearing you, but I got to tell you, we're so proud to be here today representing McDonald's at this wonderful, incredible walk for these for this incredible organization. Uh, there's about 20,000 people here in the sun. McDonald's has about 500 uh, participants in this, and it's such a special, special day for us. Uh, as I think you know, my wife is celebrating five years now cancer-free, and the YME organization played such a part in our family's recovery process. Yeah, why don't, Steve, I hope you can hear me, but why don't you tell us about how the organization did help you? It sounds like it was quite a tremendous help for you and your family. Could you hear? I can't hear. We're, we're having a tough... Oh, okay, how did Why Me help us? Well, I got to tell you, you know, when you find out that uh, someone in the family is afflicted by breast cancer, it kind of turns your world upside down. Uh, and that's what happened to us. And, and we didn't know where to turn, quite frankly. And one of the things that I did immediately is, is used Why Me to figure out uh, things like how in the world do you tell your daughters that their mom has cancer? Uh, which is a really hard decision because uh, you're worried about telling them too much because you don't want to worry them, but at the same time, you want to bring them into the whole situation. Why Me was just so crucial in helping us figure that out. So uh, between Why Me and our McDonald's family, uh, we couldn't have asked for more support, as well as our own personal family as well. Steve, in, in the five years you've been doing the walk, tell me a little bit about how your wife's situation has changed and also how your perspective on, on, on cancer has changed. How has your situation changed in the last five years? Um, well, we're like I said, we're thrilled to celebrate a five-year cancer-free now. Um, I just stopped my medication today. It was our celebration morning to stop for my medication. I'm doing great and um, just thrilled to be here and to have my family support and uh, McDonald's support. And Why Me has been a great part of that. All right. Thank you, Debbie, Russell, Steve, and, of course, their two daughters, Courtney and Stephanie. We appreciate your time. We're sorry about the technical problems to everyone else, but if you want to get in touch with the Wyoming National Breast Cancer Organization, you can also call the hotline number. That phone number is 1-800-221-2141. Now, for all you Spanish speakers, habla espanol, here's the phone number for that, 1-800-986-986. 9505. You can find those numbers and much more information about Why Me on abc7chicago.com. All you have to do is click on See It on TV.